from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. As far as the temperatures are saying, uh, things are going to get nicer as we head through the next couple of days. We're talking about climbing into the mid to upper 50s tomorrow and then down to 50 for Thursday. And then unfortunately, we start to dip into that slightly unseasonably cool territory. The good news, high pressure is going to dominate the forecast. So there's going to be lots of sunny afternoons. I do expect a couple of clouds to trickle in Thursday and then maybe a few more this weekend. But for the most part, going to really be beautiful skies uh, through the next six days. Seasonal average should hover around 49. 50 degrees, so uh, most of these days are going to be somewhere near that. Heading into the day tomorrow, at least at the upper levels, we're going to be looking at a uh, westerly component to the uh, winds here. So that westerly flow at, at the mid levels combined with southerly flow at the surface is the reason why I think tomorrow is going to be one of those days. It's going to be a little bit warmer than what we've seen the last few days. Uh, high pressure moves on out towards the east, but we're continuing to see clear skies watching this cold front that's going to be slowly dipping down. Uh, notice not a lot of moisture with it, just a few clouds pushing through the region uh, that cold front slides through late Wednesday evening. So that's going to be after we reach our daytime high. Some colder air starts to slowly filter in, but we really won't see the impacts of that colder air until about Friday. Starting off your morning, the drive will be a little chilly. We're talking about mid 30s by the time you pull into work. And then as we head into the afternoon, the numbers get better. Check out one o'clock by the time you're getting back from lunch. We're already going to be near the mid 50s, so it's going to be a nice afternoon. 57 degrees, well above that uh, seasonal average of 49. Winds are going to be out of the south at the surface, 5 to 10 miles per hour. And that's going to segue into a pretty nice evening where temperatures are going to hover near 50 through 7 o'clock, slowly cooling into the lower 40s. Won't be quite as cold as we head into the overnight hours, so your Thursday. It's actually going to start off milder. We're talking about 38 degrees driving to work, but look at the numbers. Not a major change in the afternoon. Hanging out in the upper 40s, I think we crest near 50 degrees, and then that colder air starts to sink in just in time for your Friday. That's the day I think you'll need the light jacket. Uh, temperatures in the upper 20s for the morning, lunchtime in the 30s, struggling to get into the mid 40s for the afternoon, but I think we'll hit 45 degrees. And then we're looking at temperatures in the upper 40s for the weekend. Lots of dry time, a few more clouds around for this time of year. It's not a bad weekend to maybe get that afternoon run in as long as you do it in the heating of the day. We're talking about two to four That's going to be prime time. By Monday, we're in the low 50s when you head back to work. And by next Tuesday, I'm looking at highs in the low 60s.